What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'd like to talk about world map upgrades. Now this is mainly for the console side. Um, I'm not sure if the PC side has anything uh, that allows them, you know, add-on wise to make the world map look different. But I saw this topic on the ESO forums and I thought this was really a good idea. I thought this was something that would definitely freshen up the game and also help players out a good bit. Now the world map does look kind of bland when it comes to the console side of the game, whether you play on old gen or on new gen. I think one of the biggest things that a lot of people don't like is the clutter, the way the world map looks really cluttered if you're zoomed out. One of the main reasons, of course, is all the way shrines. Now, of course, if you're newer to the game or if you're on a newer uh, character that you've just made, you won't have as many way shrines. When I go on some of my or some of my characters that I've had for a long time, some that I've used and pretty much traveled and done everything with, that world map is pretty much absolutely cluttered with way shrines. Sometimes I even have trouble finding some of the dungeons or the trials because I have so many way shrines in the way. So the option to be able to maybe filter exactly what we can see when we want to see that on console would be a great thing in my opinion. So if you want to filter off or on those way shrines, you could do that. Uh, but I think the main thing that a lot of people would like to see would probably be some better zoom options because the zoom options on console feel very clunky at times. They, you know, sometimes you'll zoom in and it'll pull and drag. And I don't know, it just acts odd. I know I used to have the issue sometimes on PS4. I've not had a huge problem on PS5, but those zoom issues are a bit weird. And I think the zoom options could be a little bit better. I think we should have some different magnifications there. Probably would help out a lot. I think also, um, you know, people have talked about having names over each region or zone kind of, kind of, uh, I guess you would say hovering over the map. That way you could find kind of an area easier without having to move, you know, your cursor. Uh, move your joysticks to get to a certain area uh, to be able to find exactly what you're looking at. I think that would be helpful for new players. Some people have even recommended adding, you know, maybe some almost colors or textures to the map itself, you know, like snow, if there's a, if it's a snowy area or, you know, a mountainous area, sandy areas, you know, kind of just add a look to the map to make it look more realistic, to make it look like more of what the zone represents. I think that would not be a bad idea either, but I do think having more options on console at least to kind of change the look uh, of that over uh, kind of overview of the world map itself would be a big help like i said the ability to you know have what we want pulled up at you know a certain time and kind of you know maybe uh, disable it so we won't have to have certain things blocking certain areas i think this would be a big big help and if we did have something like this i think that will lead into the ability to add maybe more things down the road uh, for ESO on console that would be more like what I guess con uh, maybe PC players would call add-ons for us. You know, it's usually just additions they make to the UI, but I think there could be some things added in if Zoss did decide to go ahead and update this world map. Anyway, leave me a comment with your thoughts. What would you like to see changed about the world map in the Elder Scrolls Online? And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. Also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.